Let us truly rejoice, for we are gathered together in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Friends and gracious Jesus, our divine teacher, who taught us to love the way God does. May His grace, love, and compassion and peace be with all of you. And with your spirit. As we prepare to celebrate the mystery of Christ's love, let us call to mind our sins, especially the sins against love of neighbor, neighbor against love of our enemies. Lord God, we command us to be holy as you are holy. Forgive our failure to strive to take you as our Father. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord Jesus, you commanded us to reject violence and to promote peace. Forgive our failure to follow your example of constructive non-violence. Christ, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord God, you commanded us to love even our enemies and to pray for them. Forgive our failure to forgive and pray. For the good of those who have lost us pain and harm, Lord have mercy. Lord have mercy. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Let's remind you today is the last Sunday that we're going to see the glory of. Next week will be Memorable so let us give our readiness to be praying to enjoy the singing of the Lord. Glory to God in the
Jesus said to his disciples, You have heard that he has said, An eye for an eye, and a tooth for a tooth. But I say to you, Offer no resistance to the one who is evil. When someone strikes you on the right cheek, turn the other one as well. If anyone wants to go to law with you, over your duty, hand over your throat as well. Should anyone press you into service for one while, go for two miles. Give to the one who asks of you, and do not turn your back on the one who wants to part. You have heard that people said, You shall love your neighbor and hate your enemy. But I say to you, Love your enemies and pray for those who persecute you, and you will be the children of your heavenly Father, for he makes his son rise from the bad and the good, and causes rain to fall on the unjust and to the just. For if you love only those who love you, what recompense have you? Do not tax collectors do the same. And if you meet your brothers only, what is unusual about that? Do not pagans do the same? So be perfect, just as your heavenly Father is perfect. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise be to Lord Jesus Christ. Good afternoon, brothers and sisters. Be perfect as your heavenly Father is perfect. Eh, wala nang perfect ko sa mga ito sa mundo eh. Lahat ng isa sa mga ito. May isa sa mga ito na din, may isa sa mga ito pa. Lahat tayo na mga kailangan. But again, we must try to be like God the Father. For you and I were made in the image and likeness of God. And if this is in Sunday, we have heard about Jesus teaching about the kingdom, about the attitudes, about the need of service. The greatest among you must be the last and be the one to serve. But I guess today, we are reminded again of the greatest difference of being a Christian. And that is, do not retaliate. Walk that way. That's why in yesterday's recollection of the team that Father Alex gave is, Napakakakot ba ang pagiging Christian? Kayo, napapago na ba kayo maging Christian? Bakit? Sana. Di ba ang mga Christian? Hindi kaya. Give. 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 Kailang give you. Apa. Or give. Ay, napapago na ba kayo? Or give ng kundi ka na? Tapos suwi ko lang sa mga mga suwi ko suwi ko lang ng mga ilalaw. May mangyayari. Magsagahala. Bigay ka ng bigay. Wala ka naman nakatanggap. Nagpapagsino ka. Yung iba, nagiging bigay ka ng nasiyo. Hindi na nagkakabao. Hindi na nagsisika. Ama, ang aba ka, nakapila na. But we are reminded in the first reading, Be perfect as your heavenly Father is perfect. Be holy as He is holy. Ano ba ang maging kalama? Ano ba ang maging holy? First of all, the technical term to be holy 
is separated for the sake of God. This place is so big, not because it is full of sanity, but because it is reserved for the use of God's purpose. Only in cases of emergency, begging of the shelter. Pero pwede ba kung si Fana gawin this book lang? Excuse me, that is not meant for God. So, that is to study. A person is called holy that administers our leaders, not because they are without sin, not because they are perfect, but because they are set aside for the work of God, for the duty of God. And so, each one of you is consecrated to God. When did that happen? When were you consecrated to God? Uy, nakasal ko, nahiyaka kayo. Baptism! At baptism, you were consecrated to God. You became children of God. You share in the people role of Christ as priests to make people holy, to pray, to offer for them as team in order to serve them. You are powerful, your responsibility in order to serve, not to lord it over them. And you are a prophet, but by prophet that means you teach. Teach the people of God kung ano ang tama, kung ano ang totoo, kung ano ang makakaroon. We are consecrated. And furthermore, St. Paul tells us, you are the temples of God that also took place when we were baptized. You are made the temple of Christ. And if anyone destroys that temple, God will destroy them. Did you know that you are also incense? Pagkatapos ng altar, pagkatapos ng pari, hindi incense ang hanggang kayo kapag may incense. Bakit? Kasi ang inyong katawan ay banal. E kung sinangkala ng katawan nyo, sasakalan nyo rin ba yung kapal nyo? Sinangkala nyo eh. Nakakapapal nyo, kumpit nyo, kumpit nyo, kumpit nyo. Hindi ako babae, hindi ko tuturuan ng leksyon ng kaako. But when you inflict harm on your neighbor or your fellow man or your brother and sister, you are inflicting faith against the devil of God. Therefore, the better way is not to be angry. Be done to God's justice. Lahat naman tayo, mamamatay, mag-intay na lang, katawa ng Senegal, pero sana makuha na siya. Pero huwag sana ikaw ang dahilan ng pagpahala. Because you will be liable to judge, to judge. Yes, nakakainis. Yes, I will work. I will. I will do that all of my anger. It's all right. It's all right to get angry. It's all right to be angry. But be angry and ventilate in the Bible. Go down and send me to your room for where you see her. Do you pay me for the one? Kung hindi kayo sa kasmay, sa pagsisigaw, sa pag-iya, huwag kayo ng muna, kayo ng muna, yung muna, hindi masasakta, hindi aaral, huwag na din. Kung mahilig kayo ang mutumot, huwag kayo ng mutumot dyan, kung mutumot yung yung man, huwag ka ng kalaban, huwag ka ng kalaban, huwag ka ng kalaban, huwag ka ng kalaban, hindi aaral, dyan. If you want to be more personal, 
get a photocopy of, of the picture of the one that you are telling me. That's the same thing. Good thing to you. I'm telling you not to check you, but do not hurt yourself. Do not disturb others, but let out the anger. Because if you do not let out the anger, the evil, it will eat you up. And so, we call your family and our lives. The truth, it will always to be. Have you ever asked yourself, when you get angry, when you swear, when you go to the left and right, you say, Galit kayo, o na hindi niyo siya sa mga sakin mo, walang ginagawa, alam niyo lang ang mga kaya. I always ask the professional, Sige, nagmumura ka, nagbabari ka, ano ba ba ako masira? Sagot, wala eh. Wala ka na eh, ito ba 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 ba? Hindi mo ba natanata? The more you get angry, the more mo para sinasunod na lang yun ang magaling ka. Ano mo ba eh? Sa isis ni lang, sige. Magagaling ka pala. Sige, galingin ka na yun. Mahal na isos ka, magkakaya ka, posos ka na, mamatay ka, hindi na ako na ang mawawala. Uwey. Sino ko eh? Huwag ka na. Pero kung masama na ako, kaya ka, pili mo, gusto mo ko ba magalit? Then, delay to the Bible. And as you exhaust your energy and your hatred, then turn to pray and tell God, Lord, ikaw na pahala sa kanila. Hindi ko kontrol sa sila. Pero Lord, tulungan mo ako na hindi ako magpapapekto sa anong masama ang ginawa nila o anong dapat nila tuloy na hindi nila ginawa. Lord, let me eat my food. Make me silly. And make me try my best to do what I can to improve the situation. That is the way. And therefore, it is also very common during that time that we are reminded we have three weapons to make us stronger. Prayer, Adalai, because without prayer, the Pope, Pope Francis reminds us, you will not be able to achieve anything if you do not pray. Because prayer is talking with God, trust in Him. Second is fasting and abstinence. Guto na hindi nila pagkakasting and abstinence pa. But fasting and abstinence strengthens your soul, strengthens your ability to deny yourself and offer it for others. Maguto tayo ng tipi sa mga gusto natin. Hindi naman masama. Pwede sa mga gusto-gusto natin. Let's try to deny ourselves. Then we are bringing ourselves to offer for others. And third is to do the good. Kakawal ko. We have the seven spiritual acts of mercy and we have the seven corporal words of mercy. Pakikigal mo na lang. Nasabi ko na yan sa Advent of Recollection. When you do things for others, little things, they don't have to be big, they don't have to be expensive, they don't have to be posted in mass media or in the social media. They were what God sees you in secret doing, God will reward you. But it's only if others take pictures, take evidences of your good works. Let us hope that it is 
inspire others to do the same. It will inspire others to be perfect just as God is perfect. But let us be clear as regards revenge, we do not take revenge. Instead, we reconcile. That is the mark of the whole mission. Mark Magali once said, I believe in Jesus Christ, but I will believe in Christians. Why? Because Christians are real. They are free. They do not follow the example that Christ gave. And that he was brought to his cross, carried, being scourged, kneeling, and trust. In the end, what did Jesus say? Forgive them, Father, for they do not know what they do. The Father's way is always closeness, gentleness, or rest and soil yourself safely. The Lord is kind and merciful. As He did with us, with you, so do unto others. Father, Anira, yes, Anira, but that is why we have to pray. Pray and do not do it my way, do it God's way. And so whenever you are tempted to be daddy, to take revenge, say aloud in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. Lord, please help me to forgive. Please help me to love as she has loved. May everything we do be always sealed in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Please stand and let us pretend to feel you our perfection of our faith. I will be in one of God. Thank you. 
Thank you. 